What is good all you donkeys in the hood? Young Sports here back with another video. Today, I'm baking the easiest three ingredient almond butter cookies. I'm usually busy throughout the day doing things, so I don't want something that's gonna take too much of my time up. So this is really simple and quick. First things first, what you guys wanna do is preheat the oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Grab a pan, just like this, and uh, put some Pam on it, baking sheet, put some Pam on it so uh, those cookies don't stick. Butterfly. <laughs> yes, of course. It, hmm? <laughs> These almond butter cookies are a healthy alternative to the more traditional but sugary and unhealthy peanut butter cookies. Um, I like these because they're very high in protein, so it's a good snack that you can have or dessert that you can have after you know a meal and a long day of training because they'll replenish the body, provide you some energy for the next day, you know, next big, big day of work. So um, I'm going to start off with the ingredients that we have for this. Like I said, it's three, three ingredients, easy, simple, quick and easy. And literally, almond butter, which you're going to need a cup of almond butter, uh, a half cup of brown sugar, so we're replacing that with regular white sugar because it's supposedly more healthy, so we're gonna do that. And uh, you just need one egg. Uh, so make sure you have all, the, all three of those in front of you and a bowl just like so. And this is uh, not a regular bowl. It's one that goes into an electric mixer that I have behind me that I'm gonna be using. If you guys don't have one, that's fine. Whisk it by hand, but uh, I'm gonna be using that because almond butter is really thick. Step one, apply the almond butter. Add the egg. Perfect crack. <laughs> Step three, add the brown sugar. All right, guys, we're gonna take it over here. We're gonna blend all the ingredients. With the flick of the switch, we're stirring. If you want it a little faster, you can get it going a little bit. Okay, so after you guys have mixed that up, we can now start rolling them into little balls and putting them on, on the pan. So what I did is I put a little bit of oil on my on my hands just so that when I'm making them into balls, they're not sticking to my hands so I can grab them a little bit easier. You can use like an ice cream scooper to help make the, uh, the cookies or the balls a little bit easier, but I don't have that, so I'm just using a spoon. I'm gonna do it by hand, but try not to make them too big, but the size doesn't really matter too much. All right, so I'm done rolling my cookies in the little balls, and my recipe made about 12 cookies for me, but obviously depending on how big you make them, you're gonna roughly get around 10 to 24, I would say. And the next step now is you grab a fork, and you're just gonna lightly press on each cookie to just kind of flatten them out. Time to place these bad boys in the oven. Let those sit in there for around 10 minutes and you're eating some good dessert, healthy one though, all right? Baby, these bad boys are ready and I'm ready to get a nice good taste of them, let's go. Open oven. Does this smell mm -hmm. Oh, they're hot, they're hot. Oh. Guys, you already know what time it is. It's the taste test time. Yeah. Everybody knows you're gonna try those right there, right in front of you. They're warm still. You <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go. <laughs> Tell me how you, how you feel. Okay, what do you think, honestly? Did you put peanut butter in it? No, I actually really like it. Irina, do tell her what it is. Guess what it is. It's not peanut butter. Almond butter. Bingo! No, it's really good. I really like it. Guess what kind of sugar we put in there? Brown? Bingo! <sighs> all right, for me, uh, really well cooked. First of all, the texture's nice, soft, warm, not burnt on the other side. Honestly, it's so, they're so moist in the middle. These are good. These are good. I think this is the best healthy thing I've made. I can use one with a glass of milk after a long day of training, lots of protein in here. Holy f that is delicious. So what happens when you live in a house 
with two sisters currently in here. Your mom, your dad, we got two cookies left. What a joke.